my name is John Pines and I am the Editor-in-Chief of Weapon Biology and I'm delighted to be here celebrating the 10th year of Open Biology. As you know, the Royal Society Publishing is the oldest publishing house uh, in the world. It's been going for 350 years. But Open Biology has only been going for 10 years, but it is the first open access journal of the Royal Society. And we focus on cell and molecular biology. And in the last 10 years, we have dramatically increased our visibility. For example, our most cited paper, which is a study on the pink one kinase and its phosphorylation of the Parkin E3 ligase from Dr. Mukit in Dundee, that paper has over 670 citations, which is more than 80 per year. So, publishing your paper with us, you will get high visibility. We've also commissioned uh, a number of uh, special issues, um, including one on protein fatty acylation that is part of the 10th year anniversary. And next year, we're going to have a special issue on bioimaging. So this success for the journal is largely down to the work of our founding editor, David Glover, and of course, uh, our uh, publishing staff at the Royal Society, including Uchi Okerafor. We're now building on the success of the last 10 years and trying to make open biology a place for fair and transparent review, handled by active scientists. And of course, we want to take advantage of innovations in publishing, such as preprints, and indeed we have a special preprint team under Michael Ginger, who uh, scour the bioarchive for interesting papers to solicit. We, in particular, want to bring back the excitement to publishing papers. Um, and that means we want to stimulate debate and the free exchange of ideas, which of course was the original purpose of publishing your paper. So to do this, or we have introduced a special section in uh, our papers called Opening Up, where you can freely speculate and put your ideas and results in a broader context. So I encourage you to submit to us to have the freedom to really say what you think. I hope that uh, in the future we'll be able to, to make uh, publishing your paper less frustrating and more exciting. And that in 10 years time, we'll be able to ce celebrate even greater success for the journal.